Okay, taking a look here. Uh, some of you have had some questions about how to access things, where they're at, um, what you're doing, all of that sort of thing. So first things first, we are in Unit 2, Project Time Part 1, if you click this drop-down arrow here. Uh, of course, you see homework and classwork is where we have the okay. weekly fuse preview and summary each week. Uh, and then the slide deck is available here if you need it. Daily class blogs have information. How to log in is here in note sheets and teacher notes. If you're not sure how to actually get in, it's right down here as well as rubrics for those assignments. And then I just dropped in uh, the summative first fuse challenge summative report that's listed as due Friday, but it's just because I want you to have three times that you review one of the challenges you've done, take a look at it, consider what you did, let me know your thoughts on it. That way I can give you some feedback, give you some grades, right? Because we have to have formatives that are 30% of your grade and summatives that are 70%. So you'll see them drop in three times this quarter. The first one comes up for this Friday, so it just got posted. And then how do you actually do this stuff? I think most of you that are here in person are aware, but if you're um, a distance learner, it might be more challenging. You go to fusestudio.net. The studio codes are listed at the top of the Schoology page. And then you go on My Challenges at the top, and it'll let you know the challenges that you can access. Click on anything you want to do. If you're confused about how to do it, When you get into it, there's these little blogs to help you out, the little play signs right there that can help you out as you're going through it. Hopefully that offers some clarification for everybody. Uh, and thank you. If you have any questions, obviously let me know.